Hello everybody, uh, my name is Kimberly. Welcome to my channel. This is my first video I'll be posting. Um, to start off, um, if you guys want to know anything about me, um, please write down on the comments below. And I would like for you to subscribe, hit li the like button, and um, yeah, to start with this video i wanted to uh start with a q a i know maybe everybody might be thinking oh my gosh it's so annoying like every single time somebody starts a video or a channel like they always start with the q a but it's always good to know people like the people that you're gonna be um watching right so i just wanted to give some few um facts about myself uh, so yeah first i'm gonna start with the q a and then i'm gonna end up with like some i'm gonna add on to some information that is needed okay so i have a few questions that i asked on my instagram post for those who are not following me i'm gonna leave all my social media links down below and i hope you guys go and follow me and go check me out you know not like that but just go check out my profile and everything and um i would like you guys to follow me and i'll be following people back all right here you go to so the first question the cr the first question i got on my instagram was what is my favorite color my favorite color is purple i love purple purple is my favorite color like I did my quinceañeras, um, purple, and my damas were lilac, like, you know, I loved it, I loved it, like, it's my favorite color, and currently, right now, like, my second favorite color would be, like, you see the background, yeah, yeah, that's my favorite color, or another one would be, like, light pink, that's another one that I like, too, and, yeah, the second question is, what made you want to start a channel? This is going to be something for another video that I want to um, put. But what made me start want to start a channel is I started... I watched so much YouTubers and like YouTube is something that I really like. But I never before thought that I could make it. But it's a, it's a very long explanation because... Um, there's something else that goes with this so what made you want to start most of it is because i love vlogs i love watching other people so why not inspire other people to do what they really want to do you know and i've always debated should i should i not and i was like you know what i'm gonna do it because if you don't start now when are you gonna start so i was like why not why not start now right so like all my content in here that I'm gonna be putting is like basically like let's say modest stuff um, I'm gonna like put in any like let's say since I'm Christian I haven't hit that topic yet that's like additional information so I'm Christian and everything and people might think that being Christian is hard um, to probably dress to be in part of the fashion to be part of like outside world which obviously we don't want to be part of the the outside world but we want to tell our people that are watching and like our christian people that just because we're christian doesn't mean we cannot um dress the way other people dress and be in the fashion like we can wear a skirt we can put on a shirt but we can still be in the fashion it doesn't mean we don't you know it doesn't mean that we don't have to be on the trends that are on top of like every year that are coming out like we can do that it doesn't matter like this that's something that i want to um hit on in another video but that's just a little gist of what i'm going to be talking to you about on the next videos okay so the next question that i got on my instagram was what is my nationality nationality sorry my nationality is Guatemalan and Salvadorian, but I was born in the U.S. And I ever so often always go to Guatemala and El Salvador, but mostly Guatemala. 
And if you was to ask me which is my favorite country, I would say Guatemala. And when people ask me outside, like, where are you from? I'm like, I'm from Guatemala. And they're like, and then I, then I have been saying, like, oh, I'm from Salvador also. And the reason why I don't say, like, El Salvador that much was, is because, not was, because when I go to El Salvador, like, I, I mean, when I started traveling, I never went to El Salvador. Like, it was always Guatemala, Guatemala, Guatemala. So I started going there more. And then, like, before, um, no, after my grandpa died, then my dad decided to um, have us go to, what, to El Salvador. So my dad is from El Salvador and my mom is from Guatemala. So it would always go to my mom's family side and my dad was always left out. So after my grandpa died from my dad's side, I was like, you know what, let's just, we have to go. My dad was like, I want you guys to go see my grandma and I want you guys to go see my mom. So we've been going there two times already. And to Guatemala, we've been going twice. No, forget it, not twice. We've been there, I've been there four times. And when I go there, it's a wonderful experience. I love it so much. Like, it's the best, the best. Like, I have the best travel time of my life. And I just don't want to come back. But, you know, college is college. And I have to come back to pursue school, do schoolwork. And although I don't want to do it, but I have to. Not that I have to, but, like, you know, you want to have a good success in your life. You want to succeed, you have to do certain things. So, yeah. The next question is, what are your goals in life? <laughs> the fact that I have to think about it is crazy. Okay, so what are my goals? My goals are to be a good person. Well, I am a good person, but to have good things. I know materialistic things are not everything, but... My goals are to one day, um, if God will, I get married and have kids. I know every single woman like would like to have kids. And um, another goal that I would like is graduate from college, which I have two more semesters to, and then I'll graduate. And then have a good life than what I had when I was growing up. Although, in God's name, your life is always good, but you have your little ups and downs, so yeah. Another question is, what are some of your pet peeves? <laughs> pet peeves, uh, let me think about that. <laughs> what are some pet peeves that I have? I can't think about them. Like, I don't have pet peeves, but I, there's things that I don't like. Like, there's some things that I don't like, but it's not a pet peeve, you know? Oh, I can think about one. When I organize my brother's stuff, and, like, the next day, it's unorganized. Like, that is one of my... Mo, oh, that's one of my pet peeves. Like, I do not like that. Like, I... I organize your things, and the next day is just like a whole mess, like a whole mess, a whole total mess. I hate it. I hate it so bad. I hate it. Okay. Something else. Let's see. Another question is, what is your hair routine? Because them curls look flawless. <laughs> so... My curly hair routine is another video that I have to um, put, that I want to put up because a lot of people have asked me even before I st um, started with my channel and they've been asking me, what is your hair routine? Okay, so like I was saying, what's another video that I want to do later on because uh, there's a lot of things that go into it and like I was saying in the beginning, I want to put up video up with the products that I'm going to be using and that I currently use right now for my curly hair routine. But right now, what I'm currently currently using are Shea Moisture. I'm doing Shea Moisture and it's working good, but 
there's a lot of problems with that so that's gonna be up for another video i'm sorry to um diana that asked the question i have two more questions left <laughs> and these questions are from my sister jennifer so who's your favorite sister jennifer you're not my favorite sister yeah <laughs> just playing i'm just playing i can't say that about you <laughs> Uh, to be honest, you guys are both my favorite sisters, you and Diana. And about the Diana before that I mentioned, that was not Diana, my sister, that's somebody else. So, Diana and Jennifer, you guys are the best sisters ever. Like, God could have not given me more. Like, you guys are the best. And I could count on you guys for everything. Like, you guys are, like, the best. Like, you guys are the people, like, I can talk to and cry on and tell them everything. Like, you guys won't judge me. You guys are there to hear me every time. And I can't thank God more for the people that he put in my life. And you guys are like my everything, you know? Like we go outside together and everything. Like I know people might look at them like, oh, there's the three musketeers every single time together. But the only thing I can tell you guys um, is that my sisters are everything to me and I love them so much. I know it's so cringy, I know I'm crying, but <sighs> it's just crazy. Like The amount of love I have for my sisters, they might not see it, but like I feel it and I know and God knows that I love them so much. Yeah. <laughs> And Jennifer asks, what are your favorite qualities of each one? So Jennifer, like, my favorite qualities are you is that you're not afraid to tell people, like, what you feel about them. Like, you're not afraid to tell me, like, Kimberly, if you're doing something wrong, you tell me, like, right away. You're not scared. You stand up for yourself. Like, that's very, like, incredible. Like, it's not like, you know, it's not like other people that, they don't like to stand up for themselves and to say what's right or wrong. You say it like you do not care. Like you don't let nobody step over you. And Jennifer, Diana, like my favorite quality about you is you're one of my best um, little sisters. And to be honest, like I still see you as my little baby sister. Like although you're 18 years old, to me you're not 18. To me, you're like a seventh, eighth grader, although you're going to college next semester. To me, you know, my favorite quality about you is that you're so mature that you also tell me, like, if I need, if I need un consejo, if I need somebody to talk to, you're there. Like, you're there. You will literally tell me, like, oh, you did this bad, you did this wrong, um, you should do this, you should do that. Like, you're there to literally tell me there's no um there's never a no like you sit there and you talk to me and you pay attention to everything i say unlike you know when you want to talk to a friend maybe you don't have a friend to talk to and to tell them about these things but with your sisters like you can always count on them so those are my favorite qualities about you too and i know you guys are going to start crying when you see this video but it doesn't matter like i still love you guys and i know that you guys saw through my eyes that i was hearing but yeah that's my favorite thing about you guys and to end this video i would like to say that this is gonna this is not gonna be the only one there will be more coming but um yeah i would like for you guys to please subscribe to like to put down on the comments like any video you guys want to see because i'm very excited to start this journey and thank you for coming into this journey with me um i know it's not going to be easy i know times are going to be tough i know so many things are going to happen but god is with us and yeah thank you guys so much for everything please like Please subscribe, comment down below any video. Sorry if I keep repeating it, but I have to remember that now. Okay. Sorry, guys. Bye. God bless you.